An OTDR is a sophisticated tool with many configurations and parameter settings. While the right type of OTDR can troubleshoot PON networks, proper use of an OTDR requires sophisticated training and experience. OTDR training may not always be available or desired for many technicians. Here are three reasons why you would select a TS-100 troubleshooter over an OTDR for PON troubleshooting. The TS-100 allows users to troubleshoot PON networks easily without extensive OTDR training. The TS-100 is pre-configured and powers up with the necessary settings to perform common PON testing, making for an easier user experience. Its simplified home screen displays the most critical measurements, including downstream power, link length, loss, and ORL. If any faults are found while testing, simply touch the link map graphic to view details and recommended corrective action for detected faults. Designed specifically for ponds, the TS-100 provides unique capabilities required for live pond troubleshooting. It includes a dual wavelength pond power meter specifically designed for measuring downstream power levels on each wavelength and provides instant G-PON or XGS pond measurements with pass-fail analysis. OTDRs typically include a broadband power meter, which is good for measuring power over a wide range of frequencies, but it is not sufficient for adequate PON testing when both G-PON and XGS PON are present. The TS-100 is the fastest tool for troubleshooting PON networks. Its instant-on and immediate downstream PON power measurements are evaluated against pass-fail limits and within three seconds, events to the splitter are also evaluated against loss and reflectance, as well as splice and connector pass-fail limits. Combined with pre-configured test setups, the TS-100 becomes the easiest and fastest way to troubleshoot PON networks.